Hey guys, Wagged here. Today we're going to be talking about, to be fair, you have to have a very high IQ to understand Rick and Morty. The humor is extremely subtle and without a solid grasp of the theoretical physics, most jokes will go over the typical viewer's head. And if you're wondering why my ASS, I'm not saying a curse within the first 30 seconds, otherwise my ASS is getting demonetized, uh, well, someone boosted my Discord server, link in the description, and if you boost my Discord server, you can have my intro, you can make it whatever you want, and it can be even as stupid as this. Without any further ado, I'm gonna be talking about Gen Z, Gen Z moments, and, uh, before you ask, no, I actually do not associate as part of Gen Z, I do not identify as a part of Gen Z. I may have been born within the years of Gen Z, but I myself do not qualify nor identify as a part of Gen Z, because you know what, I'm not an idiot so I don't qualify and I also do not want to identify with these people because I don't want to be grouped with them and some of the people in Gen Z are actual degenerate loser stupid people. I I'm trying to say the meanest stuff I can without getting demonetized within the 60 seconds. In this video, I'm going to be reading over tweets from an account called Gen Z Moments, and while Gen Z Moments is a perfect name because the shit we're going to be covering, and yes, we passed the one minute mark, I can say dumbass shit, whatever, just not the big Mac Daddy F word till later in the video, we're going to be covering some absolute stupid stuff. So if you haven't already, grab yourself some popcorn, some snacks, because, well, this is going to get stupid. That That's one way to put it. What pronouns do you use? He, him, his, 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 himself. Alright, that's the main one. Okay, and then H3, H1M h1z h1z and then himself okay and then okay i know there's such thing as neo pronouns so i'm gonna just stay away from that but look at the bottom one literal emoji do, you, do any of you guys use pronouns that are emojis these gen zers make me feel like an absolute boomer because of this shit man like oh my god laughing emoji self decided to go grab some books and no i'm not making fun of just pronouns i'm making fun of emoji pronouns man that is not cool if I'm ever an actual businessman, well, of course I'm going to be. I'm going to be a successful one later in life. And I'm recruiting people to, like, my YouTube house, like, the hype house, whatnot. And he walks into my building and asks me to refer to him as an exclamation point. I'm going to leave it at that. That That's enough slander on this one thing. It's going to get me canceled anyways. Just finished sanding my tires so that my car will ride smoother on the interstate. Honestly, I kind of love this look. Uh, yeah, well... You can only love it for so long before you slide off the road and die. And then an absolute G responds with saying, that's a smooth way to see God, and well, yeah, I'm gonna leave it at that. There's nothing else that can be added to that. What the hell? Like, if you don't have the traction on your tires, you're a goner. You're a dead man. Dead woman. Dead exclamation point. Also, everything in this video is a joke, by the way. Please don't be offended. Like, I'm sorry if I offended any of you. It's really not intentional, but I am joking. Manager, we're short staff for tonight. Damn, that's crazy. Good luck, though. We could use some extra help. Yeah, I bet. Good luck, man. That is boss behavior, man. I mean, whoever messaged the manager this probably got fired, but at least they got this badass screenshot to go along with it. It's kind of like a goodbye gift. Uh, does anybody know a disorder I could self-diagnose as that isn't too weird, but lets me say slurs and then the, not the basic ones like, and I'm so sad that that got cut out because I'd love to see what they had to say for that. I'd love to see what this individual looks like. Other than the pure grime from probably never going outside, this probably going down their face and the musty ass hair that I can already see, man. Like, how do people get like this? Like, I know there's a meme that goes like, they are got to text another fatherless child. But even if you weren't a fatherless child, it doesn't mean you have to end up like this, man. You can end up good. I know plenty of people that did. So, uh, I don't know if I'm the only one that thinks this, but anyone else get toxic vibes from the big H man, the big genocide connoisseur, the big bad guy? Like, just the worst person in history, possibly? No, just me? All right. Like, what do they expect us to say? No, I don't get any toxic vibes from him. He only killed people out of, I don't know, pity? Like, where do I even start? This is the most Gen Z moment I've ever seen. Why? Why was I born in Gen Z? I don't know. Do I wish I wasn't born in Gen Z? Yeah. All right, man, I'm gonna cover one more photo and then probably, you know, take a nice nap because I really do need it after seeing all this. Like, to think that some people just think like this, think like what I've showed you, just is mind-boggling. Beyond that, it's painful. It literally hurts me. So an individual by the name of Andrea says that I'm black and all right, 205 likes, that's pretty nice. And then Letho420 responds by saying, I'm sorry, I hope you get well soon. And they ratioed them. If you don't know what ratioing is, it's when someone replies to a comment and their reply gets more likes than the actual comment in general. And that usually means that the original commenter had a really bad take, but in this scenario, it's just an unnecessary ratio. And of course, it's on TikTok. TikTok's awful. I mean, just look at how much of my video came from TikTok. Then again, a lot of it came from Twitter, so I don't know. If Twitter and TikTok were both deleted, I think society would advance at least 150 years within the span of a week. But unfortunately, neither of them will be deleted, but at least that gives me unlimited content. If you want to 
Legacy Unlimited content, amazing content, well, not really amazing. What you saw today is basically how good it's gonna get. I mean, I cover awful things with some awful gameplay, with some awful commentary, but at least I do it every single day. So subscribe with post notifications on, also leave a like on the video so the YouTube algorithm will promote it because they have not been doing that to my content recently. Thank you all for watching this far. If you made it this far, comment down Gen1020 and I'll heart your comment 101020 because, well, I don't know. I hope you all have a blessed day. Go to something productive with your life because, well, otherwise you'll end up like the people I covered in this video today. Please don't take offense to me making fun of that person with exclamation point as their pronouns. I was just giving what I thought because I don't know how to even refer to someone as an exclamation point. Without any further ado, adios amigos.